Yo, I'm back with another video, and today we're gonna be checking out Red Velvet, Irene, and Sulgi. We got Monster and Naughty. Now, people were obviously recommending this since, like, you know, for a minute, and I've been meaning to check it out, but I'm a tiny bit late because checked out, uh, I think, in Hypen and TXT and maybe a few other things, but I still really wanna, you know, post more Red Velvet, so I'll do this. And then probably even some more and maybe albums like on patreon or something so i mean go check that out i mean the patreon's free so if you're watching this and you want to go over on the patreon i have like a bunch of nct stuff there but i'll probably put um you know red velvet stuff on there uh, soon enough but yeah we're gonna just get straight into this i don't know what's going on here already but irene and sulugi sulugi gotta be one of my favorite members so yeah uh like subscribe i don't know let's go this already starting kind of crazy. Alright. Like I've said before, the production is already like insane. <laughs> Those like that eyeshadow. Look, she looks like a like a cat. This bit is hella loud. I ain't even gonna lie. Yeah, it's fine. Yo, what is that dance? That the background dance is anyone? Bro, her voice is so powerful. Yo, what, what do we got going on here? Like, those outfits are kind of dope. See, what, what, is the, what is this dance we got going on in the back? Like, hello? Okay. This, this shit kind of like, it's kind of a chilling song. Bruh, Sugi in the background going crazy. God, this production is insane. Well, oh, that's sick. What the hell was that little? There's like laughing in the background. Bro, this song is dope though. Like, I don't know how to explain the dance. It's always so good. Like, it's never over the top. Never. Red Velvet has, I've never seen an over the top Red Velvet dance. It always fits with the song perfectly. And it's like, they're like making like a little monster type thing here. They do that here and at the end. These are like, bro, that shit is so creepy. Like, what is that? It's like a, it's not like a baby. See. Irene, she does first of all, she does not look like she has this voice. She looks like she would have like a super nice, uh, cuddly, cute voice. Bro, she has like a bit of a deeper voice and it really like, it really sets the tone of the song. And then Sulugi has a super, super... I don't know, how do you even describe her voice? It's just so unique. It's super powerful. They both have extremely powerful voices. She looks like a, like a tiger. 
She looks like a tiger. The dance is still crazy. And whatever we got going on here. Alright. What are these sound effects in the background? Like it's something it's like a, like a baby or something, like a baby or a cat or something. And then there, it sounds like there's an actual monster stomping around in the room or whatever. That shit is creepy as hell. I see whatever we got going on there. Alright. Bruh, this song is so nice though. Like. Then we got Irene turning into an actual monster. Oh my god, I didn't even notice how good this build-up was the first time. Also, I feel like Irene's voice is really versatile. At the beginning, she had like a super way deeper voice. During the chorus and everything past that, it's more like... Obviously, it's not as heavy. It's still like really powerful, but it doesn't have the sort of raspy deepness to it. See, is this, is this supposed to be like a monster? That laughing is still hella creepy. But, okay, well, can this go any faster? Is this supposed to be like a mo- Oh my god, yo! These dancers going- They look kinda crazy, hold up! I think- I think it's supposed to be like a little thing though. I'm a little monster. Yeah, it looks like it's supposed to be like a monster or whatever. What is- Hold on. I'm a little monster. Bro, those dancers kinda- Those dancers killed that. They made it actually like- You know, they set the vibe. And like, with the song- they said it for the music video, but now we got naughty. This is enough captions, sadly. How old is this? Three years? All right, I guess it is enough captions. Bro, was this filmed in like 4,000 FPS? This looks way too good. Is that weird? It looks like it was... I don't know. Hold on, if we get a full black and white music video... This is so smooth. This does not look like a music video. This is like it was like filmed on a phone or something. Damn, we are we are in sync. This was not what I expected the chorus to sound like. Bro, this like little choreo they got going on, 
and just full of a hand and arm movement. Also, that's kind of sick, like a little POV. This looks so weird. Like, their bodies aren't moving, and their faces, they just keep the same expression while doing the most, like, complex arm movements. Like, oh, here we go. <laughs> but this straight up looks like a TikTok edit. That part just now? Yo, they're moving like some robots. They are like, they are in sync sync. This dance is dope. Like, I feel like it doesn't. It doesn't feel like a dance, but at the same time, you know, it obviously it, it's mainly just the hand move. There's so much hand movements that it doesn't really. What it? Also, I don't even know what I was trying to say, but. What is happening? Like, what is this? I have no idea what's going on. I have no idea. What is this? Oh, I don't know what that is. I would click on it, but I don't want to get distracted because I know that I will. But this had to have been filmed in like, I don't know. Aren't most music videos and stuff filmed in like 30? This looks like it was from like 60 or 120 or something like. Also, 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 I don't know why I just noticed this or like picked up on it or whatever, but I feel like with the group songs, they are like filled with tons and tons of background vocals and like tons of ad libs and just random little ad libs and stuff. This is just filled with tons of like layered vocals instead of ad libs and stuff. It's mainly near the end you can hear it. You can hear a ton of layers. Also, how the hell did they like learn all these? How do they remember all these little movements? Like I've seen. Hold on, sorry. Just before the draw, I've heard, I've seen some K-pop dances that are like. They don't, I feel like if I knew how to dance and I was like a dancer of their caliber or something, you know, I could learn it pretty easily and I could remember it, right? And they have to remember tons for like concerts and performances and whatnot. How do you remember this? This is like... I feel like they don't repeat these movements that much. Or that might just be me, but... <laughs> you remember this? This is a sick POV though. <laughs> Mm. 
see like this is just tons of layers on top of layers It, this just looks like an edit. That looks like you can make that like After Effects. Her voice is like, I wouldn't say it's super, super deep. Well, it's obviously like a deeper voice for, I guess, like a female singer or whatever. But it's like, it has so much depth to it. Like, um, Yuki from G Idol. They both have like a ton of depth in their voice. It's just like so low, but they have like such a range where they can, you know, have a bit of a higher voice. Obviously, their natural voice is deeper though. Or I haven't heard Irene's natural voice, but I'm assuming. Look at how like perfect everyone is. All the dancers, everyone. They're all so in sync. This song is mad. I need to like look up the lyrics though. I kind of want to know what they're talking about. Obviously, we're talking about uh, Don't Call Me Crazy, or something like that, and uh, some naughty. I don't really know all the lyrics though, but I really do want to listen to a lot more Red Velvet, probably more solos and all that stuff. So let me know if you want to see that. And if you want album reactions, definitely let me know because I will 100% do it on the Patreon. Like the Patreon, I kind of just. I, I, don't, I don't post on there super, super often, but I like to post albums and stuff on there because YouTube blocks albums, so I have to usually split them up on YouTube and all that, so Patreon is just way better for that than, or until I put them on YouTube, so um, yeah, let me know, and uh, I'm going to end this here. I hope you enjoyed. I definitely enjoyed. Very good songs. Monster. Great song. Dance, questionable. Visuals, sick. But uh, yeah, thank you for watching.